the total number of political parties in Papua New Guinea before the registration of six new parties last week was 46. Numbers are expected to reach 55 with three more parties expected to register before the end of 2021. Registrar of Political Parties Dr. Alphonse Gelu said the integrity of political parties and candidates' commission is mindful of the number of political parties in the country. He explained that IPPCC has to take into account the rights that are given to PNG citizens to form political parties. Basically what we're doing is we're weighing between uh, what the constitution says and what the constitution gives to the people and the citizens of the right to form political associations, while at the same time trying to manage the number of political parties that we have in Papua New Guinea. The registrar said IPPCC would be meeting at the end of this month to consider the fate of 21 political parties that have been put on notice for deregistration. Okay, we've done that before and we will do it again. Political parties that have not complied with the relevant provisions of the organic law will be deregistered. And we are intending to do that before the end of the year. So that will, to an extent, bring the numbers down. Dr. Gelu said the commission has also indirectly tried to keep the number of political parties down by pointing out similarities between policies of existing parties to parties wanting to register. He said many groups have difficulty differentiating their policies with existing political parties. The registrar gave assurance that the IPPCC is able to manage the number of political parties as it currently stands. Mary Sela Kelaton, TV1 News.